Hi, Casper here from Bose Wine on the 28th of December 2016. Tasting a little wine I've just found we'll do it by digging around in, in the right in the inner recesses of our double depth wine rack. I was surprised to find this. It's a 2004 Tanat, Tanat being the great variety from uh, Uruguay, a winery called Buza, B O U Z A. Fairly appropriate name for a winery, but um, this is a wine that predates the Daily Drinker. So we got this in years and years ago, uh, you know, 10 years ago, uh, for Bose wine clients, just to have as a sort of everyday drinking wine, really. Tanat, great variety of Southwest France, um, yeah, um, Madiron, um, around there, um, and the Uruguayans have taken it to their own, much as the Argentines have with uh, Malbec and Chileans with Carmen Air. It's a wine, as the name sounds, tannic. It's tannic, it's dark, it's rich. It's always quoted as being the, the grey variety that has the most resveratrol in it, which is a, a antioxidant, um, and I suspect a sort of one of those anthocyan molecules. Um, so it's purportedly very good for you, but deep in colour and generally very, very, very tannic. I expected this wine, when I pulled the bottle out of the rack, I expected it to have long since shuffled off the mortal coil, I must say. But I poured it out with a little bit of hope and goodness me, very deep in colour, as you'd expect for a wine of the tannic grape variety and still really quite red, I must say. It's held its colour extraordinarily well. Let's have a sniff. Oh, and it's just, you know, it's got a nose that says Tanat, but it, you know, it's got a nose that still says young Tanat. It's quite extraordinary. Earthy, sort of dark, brambly, brooding, slightly dangerous fruit. Um, rich and earthy sort of fruit, blood-like almost. You almost imagine it's got a high iron content. Smells lovely, let's have, have a taste. And that's dense and cool and densely structured. I mean, a wealth of fine, slightly earthy textured um, tannin. It's a wine for, for big meaty dishes, it really is. But it's still in, the, in absolutely the peak of condition. 14.5% alcohol I see from the label. And you know, it's, it's a wine, I can't, I, you know, I, I wouldn't even say that this, you, this needs drinking up. You know, I could see this lasting in another 10 years. It's amazing. I mean, this is a remarkably cheap wine. It cost, cost very little. I mean, not much. I think we sold it for not much over £10 a bottle. Um, and here we are, you know, 12 years after um, the vintage, 12 and a half years after the vintage. Don't forget, this comes from the Southern Hemisphere, so the vintage is full six months or so. Earlier than it is up here. Um, so, yeah, 2004 Tanat Domain Boozer. Just extraordinary. I mean, fully alive, beautiful, fresh, juicy acidity within that dense, earthy, midnight dark fruit and these supercharged, rich. Welcome tannins. It's a it's a it's a lovely thing. It's not a wine for shrinking violets, but it's um, as I say, it's still very much alive and still very much giving pleasure. Stunning.